In this video, you will learn 10 very useful Google Chrome tips and tricks. There's also a bonus tip at the end of the video, so look forward to that. Tip number one. Many of us know that you can search Google directly from the Omnibox. This is, this is the Omnibox, by the way. Um, but did you know you can also search inside a website using the Omnibox? For example, to search Wikipedia within Chrome, type Wikipedia inside the Omnibox and press tab. Um, and you can now search within Wikipedia directly from the Omnibox. Cool, isn't it? Tip number two. You can drag multiple tabs at once by pressing the control and clicking on the tabs you want to move. So once you've selected the tabs, you can release the control key and you'll now be able to move the selected tabs. Tip number three. You can directly search for a keyword or a phrase within Chrome. So select the phrase, right click and select search Google for. Tip number four. If you've accidentally closed a browser tab, you can reopen it by pressing Ctrl, Shift and T. Some more useful keyboard shortcuts are Ctrl H for viewing your browser history. Control J for opening your downloads window and Control K to move cursor to the Omnibox. Tip number five. You can zoom in or zoom out by pressing Control plus or Control minus respectively. For full screen viewing, press F11. And to exit the full screen view, press F11 again. Tip number six, you can drag a link directly to your desktop. So drag the icon inside the Omnibox to your desktop or location of your choice. Similarly, you can also drag the page link to your bookmarks bar. Tip number seven, just like a Windows operating system, Chrome has a built-in task manager. Now the Chrome Task Manager lets you see how much of your computer's memory a site is using, its CPU usage and network activity. To open the Task Manager, click this icon, More Tools and the Task Manager. Or you can simply press Shift and Escape. If you feel that your computer has slowed down after opening multiple tabs, it is recommended that you peek into the Task Manager and identify processes or tabs that are slowing it and take the necessary action. For example, I can select a browser task that is taking up too much memory and end it by clicking the end process. Tip number eight. This particular tip is particularly useful for advanced users and developers. If I want to inspect an element of the page, um, I can simply select it right click and select inspect so for example I can select um, a piece of text if I want to find out the styling elements of a page I select the text element right click and select inspect I can then inspect the styles tab to the right of the page um, and figure out the styling elements I can also get the font used by heading to the computer tab and by looking at the font family. Now here it's Nimbus Sans. By the way, this is part of the, the developer tools um, console and as you can see this is an extremely useful feature for power users. You can find the developer tools under more tools. Control Shift I is another shortcut to summoning the developer tools. Tip number nine, you can emulate how the page would look on various devices like a laptop, mobile and tablet using another useful feature which is part of the developer tools. So simply press F12 to summon the developer tools. Now click this icon here to toggle the device toolbar. On clicking this icon, device toolbar is visible 
and you can now emulate how the page would be visible on multiple devices for example I can emulate the you know how the page would look on a laptop by you know simply selecting this option here or various mobile devices I can even change the orientation of the page by clicking this icon here I can switch between portrait or landscape view To disable the device toolbar and to get back to normal view, go back to the developer's tool and click the icon again. Tip number 10. Google allows you to play around with experimental Chrome features while they are being beta tested. Now, One very useful flag allows you to easily mute audio playing in your Chrome tab. To enable the audio muting option, type Chrome flags into your omni box oops and search for audio muting control f to search audio muting now enable this option and select relaunch now to see it in action So you can so now when an audio is playing in a particular browser you can quickly um, mute or unmute it by clicking the icon here now here's a the bonus tip that I was telling you about when you have a problem with your internet connection you may have noticed uh, this little t-rex dinosaur and the error message but many don't know that this is a game hidden in plain sight. To start the game, press spacebar and there you go. Now that was an interesting tip, wasn't it? So I hope you liked this video and found it helpful. There are more useful video guides coming your way from TechKen. Now TechKen is a new channel that focuses on technology and design. So please like and subscribe to the TechKen channel to support my efforts. Thank you for watching.